I'm your host, Brian motherfucking Moses. This is the Rose Battle League, where we take all the Rose Battle All-Stars from all over the world. We bring them right here at Jam in the Van. We put them right in front of you, and you fall in love. Are we ready for these fucking battles? This person coming to the stage I'm excited about. Make it loud for Sarah Fatimi. My name is Sarah Fatimi. I'm from Ohio, and I'm a stand-up comedian. My favorite part about Roast Battle is the community. It's weirdly enough the nicest group of people in comedy. Adam, what do you know about him? He's Jewish, his parents have passed, and he hates anime. Let's meet this guy from Chicago, Adam Kozlo. I'm Adam Kozlo. I am a Chicago stand-up comedian. What I love about Roast Battle is the rebuttals. It's my chance to hear what my opponent came to write about me, take what they wrote, turn it into mine, and make it funny. Why are you doing this to her? Because I'm tired of people thinking that all Jews hate Palestine. It's just me. It's... I'm not Palestinian. <laughs> I don't know where it is. I just know that we don't like them. <laughs> Chicago, LA, who's going first? Ladies first. Are we ready for this? Are we ready for this? Let's roast! Adam's mother is like his dick. He hasn't seen either in 20 years. <laughs> yeah, my dick is dead too. <laughs> it is an honor to be here roasting H&M Raggedy Ann. Uh, I got my shirt from a nerd website and Sarah got her shirt from Forever 72 Virgins. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm Muslim. I can't buy a plane ticket, but you have to buy three. <laughs> I get the whole row to myself. <laughs> Adam recently admitted to having a one-night stand without a condom. I don't know if he celebrates Hanukkah, but he definitely burned for eight days and eight nights. Yeah, that couch was filthy. Sarah is Iranian, or as her agent pronounces it, tan. <laughs> She will never be a woke comedian because she's a sleeper cell. <laughs> uh, thank you, Adam Panhandler. <laughs> Adam hates it when people ask what he does for a living because the answer is usually a shot of insulin. <laughs> I'm getting the pump soon. Sarah's head is so big, the bottom of her foot has the word brats written on it. <laughs> A lot of people think the Jews run Hollywood, and that's fucked up. There is no way this guy runs. <laughs> that's why I use the word control. Sarah told me uh, she dates a lot of closeted gay guys, or at least that's their excuse for not fucking her. <laughs> yeah. You know, a lot of us here tonight are in the entertainment industry. For example, I'm a producer, Adam's a writer, and his parents are decomposers. <laughs> Yeah, they did good work. They didn't write a lot for violin, but... Sarah's like a reverse Medusa. I took one look at her, and now I can't get hard. <laughs> Adam Coslo! Sarah the TV! All right, let's start with uh, Pat Barker. What'd you think about this battle? Uh, great first battle. You guys came out throwing fucking punches. Adam, it's fitting you're repping Chicago because you look like a deep-dish person. <laughs> And Sarah is also like pizza because not bad for LA. <laughs> I thought you both had great jokes. I thought you were both hitting each other really hard. Sarah has mastered the art of sort of pre-writing the rebuttal, knowing what you're gonna say and hitting home runs like that plane ticket, three plane tickets. That was really, really good. You're really good off the cuff, but your shit is like so self-deprecating. It's like getting laughs, but she's just punching you in the fucking mouth the whole time. And you're over there like, yeah, that was a pretty good punch in the mouth. I'll throw in a jab myself. You know what I mean? Like you were just getting hit a lot by both of you, but you're super, super funny. I, I was entertained the whole time, but I think just in terms of like landing punches on your opponent, I give the slight edge to Sarah, but great job, both of you. Sarah has that energy of like, one day I'm gonna be successful. <laughs> And Adam has that energy of, I can't believe I'm still alive. <laughs> My doctor said the same thing. <laughs> the fact that you were a little more organic with the riffing gave it to me that, that little bit of an edge. But I do think that Sarah had more research jokes. I thought that some of your stuff was like, 
You didn't even know what country she's from. Blame the schools for that. <laughs> like, to me, it's almost split, but I would give it to you just a little bit because you did buy three plane tickets for this. We're tied up. Let's go I here. I got picked. Fuck. Um, I thought it was a great battle. I thought you guys are both very fast. This is like the worst version of 90 Day Fiance I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Adam, I thought you really helped her by zinging yourself so she'd get a big laugh and then you would add to it, which made it a bigger laugh. And a couple of your references, I'm illiterate, so I didn't get a couple of them. So I'm gonna go with Sarah on this one, but it was razor close and you guys are both great. Wow. <laughs> Folks, LA's up one. Make it loud for Miss Sarah Fatima. Hug each other, you two. Adam, 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 get over here. Hug each other. Break the tension. Battle. 